In this video, Shawnakee, our 1986 Catalina 22, participates in an international celebration of sailing, the 20th annual Summer Sailstice. We simply registered online and described our sail plan, a day sail in our home waters, into the lower Charleston Harbor and around a small island called Chutes Folly. Mostly sunny, low 80s, winds forecast to be variable, south, southeast, to south, five to 10 knots. Riding the current, we sail on a beam reach across the harbor, making about four knots. In view, the South Carolina Aquarium and the Charleston Maritime Center. Just as we round the bend, a surprise. The James Island Yacht Club Regatta is underway, and we're in the middle of the pre-race action. A close encounter with racing boats is not something we cruisers have experienced. The captain glides us through, and I take advantage of the photo ops. sail plan. Chutes Folly is about a mile offshore of the East Battery. The island gets its name from its 1746 owner, Joseph Chute, and preserves the colonial custom of describing a Carolina sea island as a folly, meaning a green or a thicket. The brick, horseshoe-shaped structure Castle Pinckney was named for Charles Coatsworth Pinckney, a Charlestonian, and President Washington's ambassador to France. It replaced a wood fort that had been destroyed by a hurricane in 1804. It was the first ground seized by the Confederate military who planned to use the castle as a military prison. Fort Sumter Camp 1269 of the Sons of the Confederate Veterans owns the castle and hopes to restore it to accommodate visitors. The group periodically changes the flag flying over the fort. On this summer sales this day, it was the South Carolina state flag featuring an indigo field with white palmetto tree and a crescent moon. In 2003, George Preston Hip of Charleston placed this 12-foot-tall white cross on Shoot Folly Island in the name of his Bible study group. Backed by the city skyline and its numerous church steeples, the image captures Charleston's nickname, the Holy City. Then we're up the channel, past Patriots Point, and under the Ravenel Bridge to our slip at the Cooper River Marina, a perfect five-hour day sail in our home waters. Summer Sailstice 2020.